It's Ralston Live. If three's a crowd, what's four? Well, right now, a quartet of Republicans is competing for the nomination for Nevada's Congressional District 3. That's the seat being vacated by Congressman Joe Heck, who's running for the U.S. Senate. Here's a look at four Republicans in the race so far. Former Nevada Policy Research Institute boss Andy Matthews, State Senate Majority Leader Michael Roberson, perennial candidate Danny Tarkanian, and Dr. Annette Tejero. She's an anesthesiologist whom we welcome as our guest this evening. Mr. Matthews visited Ralston Live back in July. You know we have yet to hear back from those other two candidates. Joining me, as I said, Dr. Annette Tejero. She's a Republican candidate for CD3. Welcome to the program. Thanks for coming on. Thank you, John, for having me here, and thank you to our Nevada community that's watching us today. I especially want to thank your producer, Rebecca, who worked tirelessly for the last two months to get me on here. I really enjoy the opportunity, and I'd like to say that she actually spoke with my campaign staff, and she'd like you to be a moderator for our primary um, debate. That's with Michael Roberson, Danny Tarkanian, as you said, and uh, yeah, that's right, it's uh, Andy Matthews. Um, and. I also remember the last time that I was on your show, you were so kind and you gave me a gift. So I want to return the favor. I gave you a gift? You did. I'm, you I'm gave kind me of find it hard to believe this is going on. Don't get me wrong. Rebecca's a wonderful producer, but uh, here you are. You're giving me a fan now. You have a computer out here. You are now here. official fan. Okay. Now, I'm what is Dr. that computer for? Did you, did you find those pictures of me on the internet? Well, what, what is going on? <laughs> no, John. I like to be prepared because right. I know you like to ask some challenging questions. I'm going to try. You know? let's, get, let's get started. And I, I appreciate the fan. I'm a fan of the fan already. All right. Uh, Thank uh, you. So t tell people, you ran for Congress last time in a very Democratic district, never had much of a chance, didn't win against D Dina Titus. Now you're running in CD3. Why are you running? Why am I running? You know, I am one of the most diverse candidates that's out there in this race. And I have a lot of things to bring to the table. I am a bilingual. Hispanic. I am obviously a doctor, as you mentioned before, so I am very analytical, very detail-oriented. I am also a wife of a veteran. I am a mother of three children. And I have spent over a decade analyzing legislation for our Nevada State Legislature to make sure that we had the right laws on the books for our patients. So there's so much more you can go to Annette for Congress to find out. Uh, indeed, I have done that, and we'll talk about that in, in just a moment. But, okay, you're, you're, you're a successful doctor. You have a great family. Uh, you've been involved in some issues in the past. Why, why do you think Congress is the place for you, and why are you the best candidate? I mentioned that there's four other candidates. Eventually, the Democrats, we think, will find somebody. Uh, why are you the best candidate? I'm the best candidate, John, because I, I just told you some of the things that I have. A lot of the other candidates, there's only one other candidate that actually has uh, children, so I'm a parent. I add it matters that. to have children to Absolutely, for because really? I have skin in the game, John. I have children, so we have to make sure that this country is on the right track. We have to make sure that there are opportunities for everybody. I come from a low-income family, so I know what it's like to have to live paycheck to paycheck, to struggle to be able to have an education that brings me to the level that I am now. All those things, that's what I bring to the table that the others may not, obviously. All right, let's talk about some issues uh, that are gonna be important in this race. And one of them I, I mentioned earlier, which was this vote in the House on the Iran deal that, that, that right. the president uh, uh, negotiated in John Kerry.